guys, Cruel Blind Wave, I'm Eric. Rick. I'm Calvin. Aaron. And we're here with another movie reaction. This is Willow. Whatever that is. Whatever that is. Uh, we're going to be watching the Willow TV show that's going to be coming yeah. on Disney+. Plus. I drew a tree. Aaron drew a tree. I don't know if that's... I don't know if that... I, that I know. looks like, like a Willow. nuclear picture, fallout cloud. That's a tree. Yep. I didn't have a lot of time, okay? Why are there only leaves on the top? That's where so, the trees grow. Aaron, you've never seen this movie, correct? No, I haven't. Uh, the rest of us have. <laughs> yeah. Uh, in various forms of regions. Many, we, many times. We watched a trailer for the Willow TV show, Yeah. which, I mean, that's the most I know. Not about this, yep. but about this. <laughs> you know there are people in it? Well, there are, it's yeah. Like, <laughs> people in it. Uh, which I mean, people? I know Warwick Davis, uh -huh. and I know yeah. Val Kilmer was being involved, yeah. which yeah. I was like, yeah, it's Val. Yeah. But other than that, I don't. Uh, I haven't seen this movie for 20 years. Really? I would say. I bet I used to watch it on a VHS tape until it broke. Fuck yeah. So I remember it, but... Two or three times. Yeah. The last time, like two months ago. Gotcha. I've but seen you know. it hundreds of times, uh -huh. probably. <laughs> yeah. It's tough to tell. So it's good? Because we had like six movies that we really liked, and we would just watch them over and over and over again. What were those six movies? Um, like... Willow. Willow. Princess Bride. Princess Bride. Land of Far Away. No. Uh, Ice Pirates. Uh, Ice Pirates. This is his Ice list. Pretty story. Good. Um, Biggles <laughs> Adventures in Time. Biggles. Indiana Jones, 1, 2, and 3. Mm. Uh, That's six movies. Star Wars, 4, 5, and 6. Uh, nine movies. Lethal Weapon, 1, 2, and 3. Mm. And That's Bird on a Wire. That's a pretty good list and of movies. That's like 13 oh, movies. Uh, you Maverick? said six. Maverick. Maverick. That's 14 that. movies. Yeah. You said six. Yeah, but we watched six of those like... I just Not wanted the six. <laughs> well, pick six of those. No. And that was them, probably. <laughs> anyway, in trying to fit this into the schedule, this actually, I'm not sure if this uh, video comes out probably right after we've started the show, but this is officially Aaron's first time watching anything yes. Willow. Yes. Um, first and foray. it'll be a really good catch up for me as I try to remember everything going into the new show as well. So, yes. Yep. I'm so excited for him to watch this. Yeah, and you'd watch it again. I can the the clearest thing I have in my head of this movie is a couple scenes and it's just the music. Yeah. So I'm I'm ready to revisit some childhood trauma too because I remember being scared a couple times mm. of this. The, the big, <laughs> yeah. There's a couple that uh -huh. really freaked me out. Yeah. I'm excited because Rick also seems like ah, I want to watch this movie, but he hasn't offered any drinking games with it. So I'm like, ooh, I wonder what it's about. Oh, well, actually. <laughs> Seizing pregnant women. All pregnant women. She bears the mark. No! The mark. <clears throat> Man. Just seeing that lady's face made me a star trek. I know. <laughs> I don't know who that is. <laughs> I've seen that woman's face. It's like I just saw like a like a relative you haven't seen. Yeah, a, a really distant relative, yeah. I got a family reunion. Yeah. Don't cry, baby. Yeah. Why does the queen look like a nun? She's an evil queen. She. Okay, makes sense. Yep. <laughs> Checks out. Kind of looks like a uh, mirror, mirror on the wall. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Queens. Whoa. Oh, what, is that? what are those? No. Scary. Those are like those wolves from Lord of the Rings. Like, wargs. Like, yeah, they're like little little, little wargs. wargs. That music sounds like Zora. <laughs> Zora sounds like this. <laughs> she looks familiar. Yeah, well, I don't know if I know. Maybe she just looks familiar random. Oh. Oh, fuck that music. It hits. It hits hard. <laughs> Wait, so it's a girl? Yep. I thought it was gonna be Warwick Davis. You assume too much. I, I, did, I thought he was like the. the I don't you know. Think Warwick Davis can't play a girl. He can do anything. I guess you could. I just assume <laughs> not back here. I don't know. <sighs> and that could be Val Kilmer, I guess. Poor Warwick, not first film. <laughs> <laughs> I love this baby's confused face. Baby's so good. Huh. Well, damn, what you doing here? <laughs> Dude, that baby has really good facial expressions. Yay! Look at him! Young man! I thought he was gonna be the baby in the beginning. You gotta come hurry! 
Hey, cute little kid. Don't go near it. We don't know where it's been. <laughs> Look at that guy. I intimately recognize everyone. Yeah. <laughs> I like how they have like a pig. Yeah. For scale. Yes, you are. Absolutely. Under no condition whatsoever. I feel like I've heard that line before. I've said it so many times. <laughs> Chicken dirt. <laughs> This little house. Yeah. This kind of remind me of the Shire. Yeah. The mark. <laughs> Daddy, he likes you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, when they were casting babies, they must have been like, Jesus, this gig and act. <laughs> well, the face is great. Yeah. I think it's a hair, but it makes me think of a little John C. Riley. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> oh my gosh. It's definitely the hair. <laughs> He's doing the ring trick. Oh, this music goes hard. Yeah. Don't do it. You're easy. Please turn away. Don't do it! Oh. Magic. He did it, Aaron. What do you think? What if he'd been on fire? Oh, oh man. A little kidster. <laughs> Geese would be so much scarier if they came up to here on me. <laughs> right? <laughs> right? They're scary now! <laughs> They bite and twist. The thumb's on a finger. The trick. <laughs> <laughs> no apprentice this year. Huh. What not I love how they just get right back into the music. Uh oh. Fuck. Ugh. It's like dire wolves. I don't know, she was right here. <laughs> These dogs are scary. Yeah, they are. They're like weird rats. <laughs> the outfit those dogs have to wear is really good. Yeah! Yeah, fuck this table. <laughs> Looking uh. for babies. Ah! Oh. <laughs> that one guy just beat yep. it. <laughs> yeah. Was there only the yeah. one? There wasn't two? Yes! Oh no. He's a swore in a village. We need him here. Oh god, step back! All this expedition needs is a leader. Oh. Send him. And according to the bows, that leader is you, Mogul Cut. Twatha. Mogoth Rock. Twatha. Go in the direction. Whoa, I turned into a bird. Goes to Tsushima over again. <sighs> yeah. Okay. Wow. Well, that's that. interesting. Yeah. I read the signs. One day I fear your daughter will betray you. I trust her loyalty more than I trust yours. Calm down, Jafar. <laughs> Man, I hate being old. Okay. This shit was magic when I was a kid. It was. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, a lot of it still is. I wasn't even watching the movie when I was a kid. I was watching real shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this 
the cage. What? He looks weird. Hurry <laughs> up! He's in a cage. We can't give it to him. Somebody put him there for a reason. We gotta get rid of her. Those soldiers are after us. He's looking right at us. <laughs> Take care of the baby. <laughs> <laughs> Smart to raise his eyebrows. Her. You got a lot. Motherfucker. Push him in the fire. Right? Trying to take his land. There's a, a pack here with an acorn pointed at me. <laughs> uh, what a waste. Al Kimmer's a pecker. <laughs> yeah, he is. <laughs> My name is Mad Mardigan. Mad Mardigan? Uh, Mad Mardigan. Now, Bigos. Don't go near him. It's dangerous. <laughs> I don't know why it's right. <laughs> 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 gonna choke again. Watch out. <laughs> Roll charisma check. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh-huh. Oh. <laughs> Find a woman to take care of her. You thought you were a woman, Eric. Eric. <laughs> Man Monaghan! Sit in your coffin and rot. Oh, damn. Chow! Wait, Eric. You knew me. I'll be around long after you're dead! When I get out of here, I'm gonna cut your head off and stick it on a pig pole! <laughs> Don't think that's a good way to go about that. It's kind of temper. Daughter, perhaps. I might have a reason to go on. <laughs> and leave me in here to die. Not when all I want to do is protect her. <laughs> I feel better. You've done the right thing. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Gotta promise to feed her. Daddy, little darling. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> There's your brownie iron. <laughs> 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 Alright, that's it. Oh my gosh. gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Little needles, Aaron. <laughs> None of those damn things you put in drinks. <laughs> <laughs> Look at these little guys. I stole the baby. <laughs> He's not the littlest guy. The jump off is so slow. <laughs> Be around with that. Yep. <laughs> oh, it's so good going between it. sets and compositing. Yes. I bought this shit. Hook, line, and sink. Tinkerbell. I am so happy to meet you. It's a great fairy. Mm -hmm. How do you know my name? Elora Dementor. Elora, she will die if you and Elora then to the kingdom of Tirazi, where a good king and queen will look after her. You need a warrior for a girl like this. I'm a nobody. Elora, you don't want me. Tell her. I'm sure. Even for Nelwyn. <laughs> I love the mouse hat. Mm -hmm. <laughs>
Elora Dalek must survive. She must fulfill her destiny and bring about the downfall of Queen Van Horner, whose powers are growing like an evil plague. Now we got a baby again. Got a baby. Can the brownie stay with us to help? Maybe they can fight some dogs or something. <clears throat> I stole a baby. I stole a baby. <laughs> uh oh, he looks like a mouse. Man, he jumped so high. <laughs> <laughs> I love the splash. It's so good. <laughs> I think that's a weird thing to say. <laughs> Ridiculous. You're not a woman. Not a woman. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, yeah, Willow. Yeah. Luck, is, luck is a simple man. Yep. Uh oh. Oh. Damn. It's a real fucking stun. Oh, look at her. Oh. Stop what? They're trying to kill him. Oh, Willow. Kind of reminds me of like Indiana Jones or something. A little bit, yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> no more oh, man. Oh, no. Put all the weight in the front right. What are you doing? <laughs> 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 squeaky little what? scream. It's so they're, good. There's such an R2 Rupio. Yeah. Yes! Oh. Willow! Ah! Thank goodness for that tree. No! All the way in the front. Now it's a chariot. <laughs> Oh man, he hit himself in the head with his hammer. Oh my god, the barrels roll back. Oh Jesus, <laughs> so violent. That's just done really well. I like that. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Ninja stars. Ninja stars. Oh, like a batter up. You can't chase around with a lore like this. We are getting off. What? What? <laughs> oh. There it is. <laughs> My kids would be excited. They love hearing that. Uh. Uh. It's still running. So good. Yeah, it is. Now we stop Peck. Call him Willow. Stupid Titan You're a great warrior and a swordsman. And you're ten times bigger than I am. Stupid. <laughs> Are you trying to make my life more difficult than it already is? Oh, no. Me as far as the lake, but that's it. 
Go get me some eggs or something. We are not afraid of you. Now! <laughs> I love that they can just pull out that <laughs> whenever they want. Yeah. It's great. This is a dumb mellow. You that stupid <laughs> rat dream. <laughs> I love it. It's so good. It's like that's something that these Brownies would be terrified of, you know? It's glowing. <laughs> what the hell? Hello? How you get there? It's like Grandpa and Three Ninjas. Oh, shit. There's no one on this island. And you can clearly tell that from the shore. Or at least part way on the, <laughs> on the lake. <laughs> uh, I think there's a few. I think you had too many brownies. What? Come to find the great sorcerer. Oh, man. Let me grab this rodent. Yep. Well, what's going on? I'm taking this. Aww. <laughs> That's a nice one. Yeah. <laughs> uh, things you don't pick up on when you're a kid. Yep. Turn to a bird? Oh! Oh, is he gonna be in love? <laughs> it takes so much joy in that. That's a book of hot Yeah. <laughs> They're all fixed. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Beauty. Oh no. Broken dust to heart stuff. <laughs> what are you saying? This is you in every interaction with a redhead. <laughs> Not when I'm busy trying to kill that baby. Okay? I have a line. You'd be like, oh, maybe, maybe you should come to my side and we can do it together. <laughs> <laughs> I am a little tired. <laughs> Sword! Oh, wow, it falls. Uh-oh. Let's see how good he is. Yeah! He's so good. <laughs> you are great. You know, I feel like we've said that before too or something. Oh, we have. Oh that sounds familiar as well. You are great. <laughs> you are great. Oh. Oh, time to go. Now keep your sword. No. 
I might be dangerous on a sled. Yeah. yeah. I remember some of the sled crashes I've had. <laughs> I didn't want a sword in my hand. That guy just ate shit. <laughs> that guy ate shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I love it. Oh. Oh. Look at that face on that puppet. <laughs> It was a puppet. Yeah, this is a dummy for Willow. I never noticed it before. HD. You can, yeah, I, I was gonna say you can definitely notice it in HD. Yeah. This was not formatted for this. Nope. Whoa. <laughs> Jesus. But the baby. Oh, okay. He's behind. <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> Good thing it went right through there. Oh. I'm tired now. <laughs> Oh my gosh, is he in there? <laughs> We're kind of back up! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> <laughs> he was rolling for so long! <laughs> He's so spinning! <laughs> Alright. <laughs> this fucking guy. <laughs> He's not gonna help you, Mac. He's a worthless thief. Hmm. I'm not a thief, Eric. He's not a thief. Yeah, Eric. Yeah. <laughs> Sue the nail with Eric. <laughs> huh. Weapons down where she's dead! <laughs> I was like, yeah, improvise. <laughs> I like a little baby carrier wrapped around him. Mm-hmm. Keep her warm. Yeah, Eric! Alright. Buy him time. Bam! Man. He stabbed with a wooden spear. Shin. Oh, oh, fuck. <laughs> Chase you on your horse. <laughs> He's just going towards the enemy, though. Yeah, sure. It's falling apart. Open your eyes. And the... Trolls. Trolls. That was troll poo. Troll dung. I like when you do that. You love that move. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Might as well. Gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. Rider Rohan. <clears throat> what the hell? Are those trolls? 
dirty trolls. <laughs> that was freaky. So freaky. I was right out of the room. But that shouldn't have happened. I don't know what was happening. Oh, it's still going! He is hurt. That's the dumbest look I've ever seen. Oh, uh, it's so great. How did you make this out of a troll? Magic. Magic. Man, they're all out there. Okay. Industrial light and magic. 1988. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Run back in. Ah! <laughs> oh, I'm alone this. I'm a He's dual wielding. <laughs> what? Oh. See the connect in that kick. Kind of reminds me like Sinbad. The old Sinbad movies yeah, and stuff. Sure. Ray Harry Halsey. Another one? This motherfucker is 1v100. Thank you for your style. Yeah. That combo's great. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. Smash the wall. Fuck me. He cleared it. <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> He's scared of me. Tasty. Alright. Uh, Man, he's fighting everything. Gee. Oh, it's so great. <laughs> ah, yes, Willow! Ah, oh, shoot. shoot. Maybe you should have left that alive so we could kill the other guys. Guess she liked watching him handle that big monster, huh? And all those men. Same time. It's not dead? Ah! Oh! Shit! <laughs> Aaron, perfect time. <laughs> it blew, his head blew up. It's like an ass blaster. <laughs> oh, that fire thing shit in there. Yes, the shit. Yes, sir! <laughs> My stolen <story>, baby! <laughs> You guys kill me every time. Uh, you know it's just all insert shots too. Yeah. Man, she's got an evil laugh. This is not an army. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. I'll shut the movie off here sometimes. <laughs> no, 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 no. You raised pigs. I <laughs> know. No. It's terrible. No, everyone turned to pigs. 
so good. Oh my gosh. He's turning into a Gamorrean. Oh no, now she's gonna be a pig. Look at all their faces around. I know, man. Whoa. Pig. It's like spirited away. Oh, that's such a cool effect. It's so terrible having the pig feet and then the human arms. It's gonna be only Willow and this goat. Everyone else is gonna be a pig. I need the fairies. Oh! Wow. Whoa, she's an ostrich. 1988. First time <laughs> no. their morphing technology. So fucking good. Huh. That's a, yeah, that's the first time people saw shit like that, man. Sure. People are freaking out in the theaters. Old naked lady. We must undo that The pigs, let them in. Must depig them. She cannot transform them again. My spell is protecting this cat. You can imagine get us inside the fortress. But I have an idea how to get inside the castle. We all get down. <laughs> yeah. We dig. <laughs> this bitch is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Like the what is it Black Gate? What's it called? Yeah, the Black Gate of Mordor. Aragorn and them, like we'll distract the eye. Oh, yeah. He summoned armies. I love this gold armor. Man, all these horses too. Yep, gophers. <laughs> we fight too. Wilhelm! <laughs> Kale is so big. Yeah. Here's your boy we pitch, Aaron. Oh man, that sucked. Yeah. You don't die from shock, you die from third degree burns. <laughs> Infection. I won't let you kill that child. Away! How about you? Oh! Such a worried face. Fire extinguisher. <laughs> <Dude. laughs> oh. Yeah. Use the force. I was thinking Chio, Wait, but I was, said, did it just fall over? Is that what it was? Nope. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> that looked like it hurt. <laughs> Threw like a dummy in a wall. <laughs> <laughs> Threw a dummy yeah. in a wall with a string. Oh, it's so good. So convincing. Before they just had a 
old mask of a stunt double. She was so startled, she threw it across the room. Whoa. Whoa. So cool. Now you gotta fight it. It's like Tim Burton. Oh. Got little tentacle monsters on the side too. That's cool. I noticed Eric's sword is like huge to his gauntlet. Yeah. Oh, he took that sword? Mm -hmm. I don't know if I'd like to fight with that. It's like too long yeah. of a Wolverine claw. Well, you don't get any wrist like. Yeah, you leverage. have to fight like this. It's an extra long sword too. Cauldron thing to like fall on him. Yeah. <laughs> Puncher! Yes! Only. <laughs> <laughs> Both their legs up in the air. I'm the greatest sorcerer! Uh oh. She's getting stoned. It's cracking though, which is interesting. Oh, she stopped. Well, I had three of them. Yeah. You stupid hag! <laughs> With my magic, I'll send her into the... Into a... <laughs> You're no sorcerer! Into a realm where evil cannot touch her! Impossible! There's no such place! Hell the bell! Stop and hell the bell! Then after you come up, I shall destroy you and the child with you! Ah, oh, the pig magician magic. <laughs> oh, she spilled all the shit. That. Ember lightning through the skull. And there you are. <laughs> There's a lot of steps. <laughs> it was <Yeah>. really high. <laughs> Kilmer's hair. There's a little horse. 
<laughs> that was, it was just, it just <laughs> I've been bald the whole time. Throw away the whole shot. time, man. For no oh, reason. There's no so reason good. to do that. Is uh, <laughs> back to the shire. It. Hey, motherfucker's reading his book. <laughs> shit in his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's good luck. seen it in so long and I just I gotta take off guys that's all we'll stick for, around for the discussion but I just it just was a nostalgia fest for me there's nothing bad about that but I hope I didn't ruin <laughs> the reaction for you just because <laughs> like I, it really did feel like going to a family reunion or something to seeing people seeing so many faces for a very long yeah. time really looking yeah. through a photo book your mm -hmm. child yeah yeah I really did like every single that actor person. that popped up I'm like oh yeah 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 so I'm so excited to get into the series honestly <laughs> yeah but alright see you guys so what did you think Aaron it was interesting it's definitely a you know one of those fantasy world kind of stories I feel like a lot of I'm trying to remember the dates of everything coming out, but there's things where I'm like, that seems like Indiana Jones, or that feels like Star Wars. Oh, yeah. I know it's all before Lord of the Rings, but yeah, yeah, like Lord of the Rings stuff, whatever the, uh, I can pull in. But at least the films, but the books were definitely out. By now. Yeah, like I had those kind of feelings with like the the sledding down the mountain, yeah, or mm -hmm. the the fighting on the carriage or cart or whatever. You know, like yeah. those kind of moments just feel kind of Indiana Jones ish. Um, yeah, and this is George Lucas Lucas films, you know. Yeah. So it does have that feel to it. Yeah, he had big plans. Uh, the movie did not do very well. Yeah. Not as well as they expected. So uh, the feature movies got turned into novels. Oh, really? But I think George was busy working on, like, episode one, so he couldn't oversee them, and he's disavowed them now. He's not happy with how they turned mm. out. The books? Mm-hmm. Mm. Gotcha. NES game's pretty good, though. Yeah. Oh, really? Haven't played yeah. it. No, I mean, it was interesting. I like how, like, the the pig magic disappearing trick came back around and he used that again. Though I don't really understand why the queen died, you know? I, I think, like, the nether realm's taken somebody, right? Like, the ritual started, that baby's supposed to be there. Now that it's not there, like, she spilled the blood on her. And you're right there. So yeah. She, get she spilled the blood. She kind of, like, soured the spell. Okay. And it rebounded. Yeah, I always thought, like, the, the idea is to pour that blood on the baby, and whatever the blood is on is what gets taken, and she, like, spilled it on herself. Gotcha. <laughs> okay. And, yeah. plus, she was getting electrified, too. Well, sure, yeah, <clears throat> I guess. But it was just, like, there was, like, more to it, and the way the red stuff was coming up, and I'm like, what happened? It yeah. wasn't super clear. <laughs> so, and then, like, I wasn't really sure on what Alora was, like, there was, like, a prophecy of this kid, and that it would stop the queen and stuff, mm -hmm. but I didn't feel like the baby did anything or I figured it was going to grow up and then it would be important but sure. it seems like we defeated the queen I think the idea is like the anything. baby brings these people together who will then save the day and then now this is like the King Arthur that will rule in prosperity yeah. like her process of trying to stop the baby then ultimately <clears throat> brings her downfall because it causes this chain of events to occur yeah, kind of sure thing. Like when it was like we're we've seized all the pregnant women, I'm like Jesus. <laughs> this is not what I thought this movie was gonna be about. Like be about. I thought it was gonna yep. be different. No, there's some like crazy deaths in the beginning. From, like yeah. these two motherly figures. Like the one is off camera, but sure. she clearly dies, and then the other one we just eaten by, dog, by dogs, dog rats or whatever they yeah. are. Crazy. Sure. Uh, trolls are interesting. They look a little different. I was curious on what General Kale's mm -hmm. like mask was like, supposed to be because it was like a skull, but it didn't look like a human. Didn't really look a troll. It almost looked like, I don't know, like some kind of like big, like gorilla or something like that. Because it had kind of like these outward, like not snout, but yeah, like the, the mouthpiece. Yeah, yeah, like it kind of has this part here. But then like its teeth were just so much sharper than I would think they would be. So gorilla teeth have, they're quite sharp. 
Yeah. And like the canines, they they do come down. That's just what it kind of reminded me of a little bit. Was like think about like Kong or like something Caesar like Caesar from like Planet of the Apes yeah. or something like that. Like if like he's they get kind of big, I guess in those. He's also but they're a not gorillas. Uh, he's an ape. Yeah. So it just reminded me of something like that. But I was just like, what, what, what are these creatures? Now, we saw trolls. We didn't see dragons, unless those two-headed things were dragons. <laughs> Whatever those <laughs> were. Fire. I yeah. Don't know. I don't know where, I'm not sure where they came from. We just turned a troll into one of those. I was like, yeah. the melting of that was crazy. It was like bloody. And I was like, Jesus, what happened? How it like clawed its own skin off. And, yeah, and like it hatched out thing. a new thing. I'm like, what is, what happened? So disgusting. I thought he just like killed the troll, but he burned and the that, whole And that, people creature. turning into pigs. Like that's oh, nightmare yeah. stuff. Yeah. Especially was, if you're a kid. It kind of reminds me a little bit of, uh, I don't remember Wizard of Oz too much. I know people didn't like the flying monkeys. But in the Return to Oz, mm-hmm. there were like those roller skating yeah. creatures that I know everyone freaked out about, and like I remember them being kind of creepy when I was a kid and stuff too. But yeah. I was never afraid of flying monkeys. But those things, just something about them was just scary. So they could be like more real, kind of. I, mean, I guess I don't know. Well, they were like people. I, like the costume was like people. I don't know if you have ever seen it. I haven't. But like they have like wheels on their feet, and they have like wheels on their hands, and they oh, wheel wheel yeah. around like this yeah. and stuff, like on the ground. They're like gotcha. chasing you around, like ah, and like running around. Oh, it was just creepy and weird. And, yeah, I, I said that, showed this DV a couple of months ago, and like yeah, the dogs really got to her. Yeah, and um, what else was all the people turning into pigs? Yeah, it's creepy. That one yeah. shot, uh, I don't know which one of you guys said it, but like it's pretty effective where it shows like it's like the bottom half's like pig like, and the top half is still human like, yeah. and he's like oh, it's like when they're when someone's died and they've been cut in half, yeah. and they're like oh, trying to put their intestines back in, like from a zombie movie or something. That's what it kind of reminded me of. But, like, a lot of stuff from when I was a kid that freaked me out. Like, she watches, she's like, ah, whatever. Because, like, effects are better sure, in some sure. cases. Yeah. But, yeah, there's still stuff in this that, like... There are some things out. that look pretty good. Like, I love the hooves on people. The the rat dog things looked pretty real. Like, you probably just took a dog and put some stuff on it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think it was a Rottweiler. Really? I think I read. And, yeah, they put a costume on it. The daughter, the redhead, was, like... Sorsha. I don't know. I'm not sure if she's just like, my mother doesn't love me, but he seems to love me, and I like the feeling from that, you know? Yeah. But, like, it didn't... I didn't fully get, like, a good translation of what she was going through, I guess. In the beginning, she didn't seem like she was getting any kind of respect from her mother. And sure. when her mother was, like, chastising her, the general was, like, smiling as if he was enjoying the, mm-hmm. the torment that she was going through. She, you know, wasn't put in command of the army. You know, she wasn't... You know, respected by anyone, really. So she just felt out of place. Was the Jafar guy one of those guys at the end, mm-hmm. like fighting, and she killed? I think yeah. so. I think he was the guy that the uh, the D'Artagnan blade came out of her sword mm-hmm. and she stabbed. Okay, I was trying to think of where he went too, because like there was a few of those guys that just looked really similar. There was like an old white guy with a long beard, yeah, you know, in black robes. But yeah, I don't know. There was a conversation about like she'll turn on you, and it's like I trust her more than I trust you, and. I'm Oh, okay, and then he's like, "Ah, she turned on me. How could I have known?" He's like, "Well, he told you." <laughs> yeah, you know, he's some kind of magic. Like, you're some kind of magic person. Like, he must be some kind of magic person. Based on her should, logic, listen to him, I guess. Based on her logic, if Sorsha turned against me, then I should kill him, because <laughs> it's so much more likely that he's going to turn on me now. <laughs> yeah, right. The loyalty thing that she yeah. said and stuff. But, like, the magic in this universe is crazy powerful. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like some of the most powerful I think I've ever seen in a movie. Yeah, just like you just take out armies. Yeah. Yeah. No, you turn a troll into a big dragon monster thing. You, <laughs> you, you turned a whole army into pigs. We, I don't know, threw a rock in the air and turned to a bird. Yeah. Th- there's some pretty funny moments of things that happen in this. Yeah. Like, like ha ha, and it's like, follow the bird. Like, it's going to the village. Follow the river. <laughs> Ignore <laughs> like, the bird. Ignore follow the, the river. river. Yeah. I, li- I like some of those. A- anytime, yeah. like, I just am reading a story about a wizard, like, that guy's voice is what is the voice in my head. Is yeah. it? Yeah. 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 It's just my default wizard. No, he was pretty good. I liked him. Other than uh, maybe Gandalf, he's the most wizardy wizard who's ever whizzed. (laughs) (laughs) He's great. (laughs) And most of the comic relief comes from the brownies. Yeah, Yeah, sure. Which, you know, like some of that stuff looks great. Mm -hmm. Some of it, you know, not so much. But Some of it looks great for the time. Yeah. Some of it still looks pretty good. Yeah, definitely. Like, yes, some of the shots where they're just going between compositing and just them in that giant sets yeah mm-hmm. like really rolling over the them. apple and chopping the rope on the barrel yeah like the one shot of them great. hitting that barrel thing was good and the next one's like i can tell that's composited in as yeah. opposed to just being a big set that they made and sure stuff. but 
it's cool the way they did a lot of that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I was wondering, like, I was looking for uh, Kevin. Like, I'm familiar with Kevin P Polak. I think is how you say his name. And I was like, oh, I wonder where he's going to be in this movie. I didn't know he was in this movie. And then, like, we were going through, and I'm like, I don't know where this is. Maybe he shows up later. And then at one point, it was just closer on that brownie, and I was like, it's him! <laughs> I, how, long, how long is he? I didn't, I didn't notice it. <laughs> That's great. So, that was cool. Um, the acorns, I thought, would be more through the movie. Yeah. But we kind of just had them twice, I guess, right? He dropped we one. We had him used twice, yeah. And then it didn't work on her. So, mm -hmm. honestly, they never worked. <laughs> no, not really. No, you know, the, that wizard really didn't do much for him. No. <laughs> uh, other than give him, like, a general direction yeah. where to go. Yeah. And maybe the confidence to, like, no, you... You have the greatest possibility of everyone in the village of becoming a great sorcerer one day. It's like you just need to trust in yourself, mm -hmm. which is why he didn't pick his own finger and become an apprentice in the first place. So I do love that he was like he was the first like page in the book of becoming a wizard. Sure. That he read, but yeah, he's he's the best wizard in their village. <laughs> sure. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. I mean, his bird thing didn't pan out, you know? No. Like, he's done some stuff, but... But no one else has turned apples into birds. No. And he... No. The bones don't do anything. <laughs> no. Nothing. Bones tell me nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I did like, it was like, they need a leader. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, what was it? What was the guy's name? Vongar! Or whatever his name was. Like, Vongar! Get back here. <laughs> so, I thought that was pretty cool. The Death of the Broken Heart. I, I don't know. There's a few moments where I'm like, is some of this stuff going to be used for the final stuff? Yeah. But... It's kind of just used to kind of like start the uh, she whatever Val's Little character's name was. So yeah, like kind of start Mad getting Martin. that. Yeah, Mad Mardigan. Getting them rebooted to mm -hmm. having a love interest thing. And he's like, I didn't mean that. And he just stares at her later like, <laughs> I, <did. laughs> I love that like she's going over it with him. Is like, did you really mean those things that you said? And he's like, I don't remember. It's like, you dwell in darkness without me and it went away. And that's when she gets upset and she breaks out. And leaves. Like, she could have at any point. But it was because she was upset that he didn't actually love her. Sure. And he broke out. Yeah, I get you there. Out. That's funny. I like that. Hmm. Yeah, I love the performances. I like a lot of the effects. The movie drags a bit for me. It's sure. one of those movies that I, like, watch in pieces. I don't normally watch it all at once. I yeah. get what you mean. I think there was a little bit in the middle part where I'm like, okay, we're still kind of going and, like... There's some cool magic moments and stuff, too. But... There's a lot of, like, traveling to a place to be captured and brought back to a place. Yeah. Rather than travel to a place. Sure. There's a lot of that. Yeah. It's true. The pacing is is broken up a bit by the by the wide, like, shots of them walking through a, a beautiful landscape. But, yeah, it does kind of break up the, the pace a little bit. Yeah. Something I didn't mind when I was a kid. Because I was like, oh, yeah, sure. nothing's happening right now. I'm going to eat this food. You know? <laughs> <It's> just... <laughs> Yeah, but no, we have, like, we have them getting caught, and they have to escape on the carriage thing. And then a little bit later, we're, I don't know, stuck inside that other place. And then we have to escape on horseback, and we get caught, and we have to escape on snow. A sled. And, yeah. yeah, so there's a lot of, like, caught or close to being caught and escaping from yeah. whatever yeah. thing. So, no, I get you. But best performance by a baby. A baby in any As film ever. Great Babies. looks. <laughs> like it's I don't a, know. It's a set of twins. <laughs> I don't know where they got the baby babies. I don't know. I don't know. If it's CG, it could be CGI. I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> no, they, the way they did that, they just like we need to get this baby to make as many faces we can and put the, just the right ones in every time. Yep. They must have filmed that baby for hours <laughs> just to get those like those. I don't know. Twenty shots they used of it. There was a. It's a set of twins, and when they needed a. a crying baby they used one twin when they needed a happy baby they used the other because <laughs> different like, temperaments yeah different temperaments of just, like that one when I, which is like ah! and that baby's like <laughs> yeah <laughs> the fuck's wrong with you I was, it was looking like I, like I, I loved that that was great so now that baby I think yeah I think it might have been one of my favorite parts of it, it was just the baby it had like like baby expressions of the what you talk about Willis mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> no yeah I like that Val Kilmer was a character. For a second, I thought I didn't. I missed him in the opening credits, and I was like, "Man, that was weird." I figured I would have seen Val Kilmer on this list. I saw Warwick Davis, saw Kevin Pollack. Like, no, George Lucas was upset that Warwick wasn't first build. Really? Because yeah, he's the star. Yeah. Right? Well, it's called Willow, and he's Willow. Yeah. yeah. Like, why is he not first build? That was interesting too. Whenever they like, they kept making her a different animal. Yeah. And they had the one where it transitioned to like six animals. Yeah. yeah. The ostrich and then the, the turtle. Yeah. The that lion. was pretty cool. Yeah. I like that. Or tiger rather. 
No, it was super cool. Out of this world special effects for the time. It's yeah, a magical sure. movie. I can see that. Definitely. In a magical world. Curious to see what they'll do with the sequel mm-hmm. series yeah. or whatever. You know, like, will we keep Alora in it and Warwick and his family and stuff? Like, how many things do you bring back? What do you keep new? You know, like usually with something like this, you want to introduce new people because it's been so long. Yeah, like you is, need, sure. is Willow now the expert wizard? Sure, like yeah. Teaching young teaching is he like people, the right? archmaster for Elora Dannon, who's now yeah. the queen. Or sure, something? yeah. You have Elora, who is now like that's who we have to push as being the queen, or you know, teaching them to be a wizard or whatever the case is. Because somehow she talked to the great fairy lady. However, that works. Sure, right? It's like Elora wants you to be her well, guardian, it's like Grogu, right? Sure, and Luke. Or um, not Luke, uh, Ahsoka. Yeah, I guess a little bit. You mean like on the stone and communicating to him and reaching out and bringing him in. Well, no, like she was. She was communing with him. Yeah, so right. like, like that's how they got the his name, name is Grogu. Right? Yeah. yeah, but he's also old. Nice, but yeah, this is a special how, baby. I don't know how that race works. So it's got a mark. Sure. Yeah, it does have a mark. Had a mark. I tried to draw it. I don't know if that's right. <laughs> Looks something like that. I think it's kind of like that. I liked how they like they had the no ones and they're like ah the Daikini the giants. <laughs> yeah, and I was like, okay, but they then talk- they had smaller people than them. I wasn't expecting the brownies to be so little. Yeah. You talk about Val Kilmer's performance. Apparently, he improved a really? lot of his stuff. Yeah, from what a, I read. There's a few moments that felt like Val, not Val Kilmer, <clears throat> felt like Michael Keaton to me. And then I was like, why do I keep thinking Michael Keaton? I was like, they're both Batman. <laughs> so that went in my head. But I liked it's ridiculous. Uh, <laughs> the very first time he fought with his sword, though, I thought it was silly, and I was like, well, all right, that's okay. But then I just love Orgby like. You are great. You are great. And I'm like, I wasn't that impressed with the sword fight. <laughs> sure. But I just love Warwick being like, wow. <laughs> well, it's something that he can't do, and he took out three guys in like five seconds. He, he thought so little of him. He did. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, up to that point, he had seen him do <laughs> no. jack shit and get them caught like three times. <laughs> sure. He, he unleashed, uh, what's his name, the jealous husband. Yeah. Yeah. Lug. That Lug. saved him a little bit there. Not a woman! Spelled ah. with two L's. <laughs> But no, I think overall it was fun. I enjoyed like the general story of everything. I like seeing Ward Davis and yeah. stuff. Like I, I love seeing him every time he shows up in like a Star Wars. He's in like all kinds of Star Wars stuff. So mm-hmm. that this is my first time seeing him be like a main character in something. Yeah, I would have liked to have seen more of these movies. I definitely now would we get a show. Yeah, yeah. I'm very curious to see what they do with that. And that comes out here real soon, or that's already come out, depending on when for you guys watching this. Yeah, could be. So. But no, I'm yeah. Warwick's placement in that, I assume you take like what thirty years, <laughs> twenty years, eighty-eight, however long it's been. So how old I am? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So you take those kind of moments there and you age it up, and but like, what's the evil? What's the problem? And we have like the queen who's been destroyed or whatever. So. Sure. Or we don't know where she is. Yeah, but it will be interesting to dive into more of the lore of like this world. Like, yeah. whatever they have and what they do. And, you know, I don't think we saw dragons or whatever they were called. I think it was dragons. Trolls we saw, brownies we saw, but what else is there? I I don't like Eric's sword. Oh, yeah. the stabby thing? I don't like it's not a terrible. sword being on a gauntlet. If it was shorter, I think I might like it maybe. But Like, if you have a shield maybe or a net and you're, like, you're doing that. But, like, sure. as just its own weapon. I as a close-range weapon, it's really not great. Sure. As a long-range weapon or, a, like, keeping someone at distance, I think it's a lot better because you have much more leverage with your elbow than you do your wrist. Sure, yeah. But if you're wanting to actually, like, fight and block your leg sure. and stuff, it becomes a lot harder to do, especially as long as it was. Yeah, you it's know? probably a lot better on horseback, like, say. Yeah, Wolverine works, but his only come, you know, so sure. far. So he's able to, like, block it here, here. But, yeah, like, usually those move. things are... Push daggers, yeah, mm-hmm. and they're much shorter. Sure. Yeah. So I like how Val Kilmer used it later, where he had it more, and he was like blocking with it, and then he like blocked here and then stabbed him. Mm-hmm. So I thought that that one played out better, but but most of the fighting was okay. Was yeah. my favorite. I love Val Kilmer just showing up out of everywhere, killing all these guys, <laughs> dual wielding crossbows, <laughs> and then crawling through the sewer or whatever he did. Yeah, it's so. great. Launching himself with the catapults. Just yeah, smacking the wall, falling down. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but but no, I think it's uh, I think it's a fun little ride. I think my kids would enjoy it, and uh, just seeing like where's what's the what progress do they make for the next series, yeah. mm-hmm. the new series, and like what kind of uh, well, how, how's the story go? How do you do you 
take into account what they wanted to do with books or whatnot and put that in with a story separate from like many years later or do you don't talk about those at all or do you treat those as if they happened like I don't know how much George Lucas doesn't have any say now probably not now no. so it's probably whatever Disney wants to do so sure I'd be curious to see like if they want to use those books or not use those books or, yeah. or what no I'm, I'm curious as well yeah, I'm curious how much they've spoken with him, like to get his like true vision of of what it was supposed to be. Sure, you know, since he says that no, this is absolutely not what I wanted. Maybe they're like, okay, well, maybe we avoid that. Maybe we go more this way and like show it to him or something. I don't know. Sure, I would be hopeful of that though. I want to say so far, but there's been several new things that came from like my childhood when I was younger that I really loved that they've made like a reboot slash sequel series to recently that have all come out pretty well I think of the mm-hmm. ones I'm thinking of um, so I hope that they do well with this for a lot of people who have this as like a childhood movie that they grew up watching and stuff definitely yeah and I just want it to be good for Warwick's sake yeah, yeah I agree well, I, I know what you mean like I love watching him host stuff and whatnot, but yeah. I, I like seeing him in different movies and things so. he's yeah. been in some good ones he's been in some bad ones sure it happens so, hopefully this is a good one wasn't he who was Leprechaun him, right? Was it was it Warwick that did? I want to say it was, but I can't remember. I think it is. I think it is. You like too. it is, long, but I haven't seen it. I don't yeah, know. I know. I've watched him. I haven't seen him in a long time either. But I think it was. Uh, I think in the first one there was Warwick Davis and there was Jennifer Aniston. Those were like the two names I knew, and that's why I watched the movie. <laughs> I was like, I'll watch this for Warwick Davis and Jennifer Aniston. That's what I'm thinking. So, and yeah, just like there's a, a village of little people. Yeah, sure. a lot of work for those actors in this movie. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. Something about George Lucas and his writing and stuff had just a lot of jobs for little people with between Ewoks and Jawas and this movie and stuff. So it's, it's always cool to have like, and it's a neat way to have like, like you have the dr- Drakini, Dakini, Daikini, Daikini. Mm-hmm. You have the Daikini, then you have the No one, then you have the Brownies. Like you're having all these different like yeah. sizes of people and looks of people and stuff too. So it just kind of adds to like. This is not Earth. There's lots of different yeah. trolls, you know, magic and stuff like that, too. So I like that they just kind of... Like, you could have done Lord of the Rings and used little people for hobbits, maybe, or something like that. But trying to switch it to, like, the composition shots and stuff they do, like, was done really, really well. Yeah. And it's kind of like what they tried to do here with, like, the brownies. Yeah. And then you had, like, Warwick, and then you had Val Kilmer, and you had all these sizes of people and stuff. I guess it's in, like, a pseudo-European country, but all white people. Now that I'm thinking about it. For? In the movie. In this movie? Right. Well, the some of the little guys weren't. Yeah. Oh, yeah? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. No, like, we talked about that one guy Volcar. who was like, that guy's from Bad Santa, I'm pretty Volcar sure, right? And, and the guy with him, they were... So, no, there were, I don't remember any... I don't remember the bigger, like, tall people. But no, it's just interesting to see, like, how they would do that. Because I think, like, I think of this, like, a lot of, like, D&D. Oh, yeah. And you have, like, sure. orcs, trolls, gnomes, dwarves, humans, elves... And they're all good at different things. Yeah. Too. So I like, like, okay, well, maybe the, the the little Nelwins are more magical than, you know, whatever. I mean, you have fairies, and they seem very magical. And it's like, as, a, as you get smaller, <laughs> sure. you have more magic you have, that like, you can use, you know? Nelwins, brownies, fairies. Yeah. And as they go down, they have more magic, like, condensed. It's yeah. like a, it's like a uh, immature copperhead. They're more poisonous than the adults. I suppose so. Yeah. That's exactly what I was thinking, Calvin. <laughs> yep. Exactly. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching our reaction to Willow the movie, but Willow the show is coming soon or is already here, so make sure that you are subscribing so that you can check out those reactions as they come. A bunch of other stuff mm-hmm. that we've done as well. We've done uh, the Lord of the Rings show on the mm. channel. There's Ooh. a bunch of fantasies on the channel, so go back and check some of those out as well. Indeed. Thanks, guys. <laughs>